You know, I don't really know how to do this video. Um, I bet you're wondering what it's about, though, because just in case I'm gone or I'm removed. Well, I got a notice, well, a, a note, message from Gaia Clary, the creator of Avastar. And um, she asked me a few questions. And... Um, I answered them as honestly as I could, you know, <laughs> but um, I don't know if that will fly. And she asked me if I thought that it was a good idea to give Avastar away for free when her and her team work so hard on it and it doesn't cost as much money as it should for what it does. And... Um, I'm like, yeah, I, it's not like I'm giving out the latest version of Avastar defeating your profits. I'm using an old, obsolete, discontinued, no longer supported um, version that, you know, her staff even told me all of that. Like, if you go and ask them about, I'm using 1.1, they were like, why, and use 1.7, that's what we give customer support for hell I'm sure that's even going um, down recently and like I said um, they're on 1.78 I think or 1.8 a new one just came out Dev developing into 2.0 and I'm way back here teaching you guys on 1.1 so I don't really see how it's hurting her I guess and half the time when um, you guys download this and you learn all the basics that I teach you you go on to buy the latest one anyway and update because I get people who uh, send me private messages both here on YouTube and on uh, the Goon Squad website asking how do you do this and I'm on 1.5 or how do you do this and 7.8 uh, 7, 7 and I'm like uh I don't know I use 1.1 <laughs> but I think what bothered me the most is that you know she says it's cheap for what it is and considering that most blender plugins around the internet are free it's not really that cheap but um I just hate that it perpetuates that idea that in order to create in second life you have to have money and I've always expressed my distaste in, in that principle, that ideal, that if the only people who can create are the people who can afford to learn how to do it. And I hate that so much. What if I couldn't afford the stuff for it? This is Second Life. You know, I don't, I don't know what they tell you now, but back when I first joined, they really pushed the anything is possible everything can be done here in Second Life. You're, the only limit is your imagination uh, kind of thing here. And um, now that seems like it was a distant time ago. Now it's your only limitation is how big your wallet is. If you can afford to buy the tools, then you can create. And I don't like that at all. I remember back when... Um, guy used to be cool well you know I can't really say that because she has actually helped me out a bit um, even more so recently <laughs> um, I remember back in the days of sculpties Gaia created the Primstar plugin so that you can make sculpties with blender and um, they had a free version and when that was distributed, everybody was making sculpties of everything you could think of. There were rock sculpties, heart sculpties, um, you know, everything was made out of sculpties because everybody had the tool they could access for free. And then later on, she came out with the Prince Daughter thingy, Mabob, the paid one. And, you know, everybody was like, Ugh, yeah, I know, we can do that with land and stuff, but I'm happy just being able to create. 
So there were people who took their craft seriously and wanted to go to the next level. But the fact that she offered a free one gave everybody else who couldn't afford it the ability to create. It may not have been as high, precise, or as gorgeous as the new one was. Or didn't have it wasn't as easy as the paid one. But, you know, people. she still gave people the ability to create. But now, when Mesh came out... Um, and your only option is to pay to create, you know, you've seen a severe drop in creative will, or, you know, and that's what I'm here to fight. I want to give people the tools they need so that they can create, so that that old dream of Second Life being a creator's paradise can come back one day. Now, I'm sure people are thinking, like, well, that was wrong of you to do that and it's your bed like I remember seeing somebody mention our channel and the Avastar group and the admin going bananas on them but it's like this I may be the evil thief stealing person who's bad and everything else that you can call me but how many people have learned off of me how many people have been able to create because of the evil that I've done versus how many people have you helped by turning them away because they didn't have the proper subscription their subscription ran out how many people weren't able to do anything because you know you're like oh well go read the blender manual or sorry your subscription has been expired we don't support your version anymore we can't help you until you insert another five dollars or twenty seven dollars because that's something else they didn't tell you now it's a subscription thing every year you got to pay another twenty seven dollars or whatever the price is going to be to renew your plan to get support and i just you know further on you got to have money to create <laughs> And I don't like that. So, in case I get taken down, I promise that I'll try to come back. Um, I promise that I'll try to come back as soon as I can. Uh, whether it's here on YouTube, um, we have a Facebook page now so you guys can talk to us or talk to me on there. And uh, we even are trying to ex go to more places that host videos just so that the lessons and the message that everyone should create is going to be out there. So I guess that's my only wish is that even if I'm gone or whatever, that you guys continue on teaching and helping everybody else just like I taught and helped you. It may not be the right thing to do, but it's the right thing for everybody as a whole as the second life community as a whole that we help each other even if it's <laughs> through shady methods so that everybody can create and that everybody can experience that joy you felt when you um first rigged your pants or something with us i mean it's been a year a whole year man how many things have been created during that year because of these shady methods I wonder I wish I could see it damn I'm gonna start crying again <laughs> okay well I guess I should cut this I should end this it's gone on long enough um this is zero and in case I get the boot know that it was a pleasure teaching you all and I'll try to keep making videos until the day they finally cut me off. So, I guess I'll see you later in the next tutorial. Bye. <laughs>